is going on everybody welcome back to phones and drones so with all the new talk surrounding the new galaxy z flip 5 i wanted to go ahead and revisit this baby with you guys here obviously that moto razor plus or moto razor 40 in international markets this baby right here has been a pleasure to use and uh, if you follow the channel you know we've done a whole bunch of videos on it and i really think this baby and the way motorola implemented this cover display and all of the options for it I think this is actually still the most useful and beneficial solution over the Z Flip 5. Samsung obviously has a much better market share here in the US than Moto does with their foldables. However, with this newcomer to the party here, I think it really does challenge Samsung and give it a run for its money. I think processor-wise, camera-wise, everything, this holds its own very, very well. Um, I believe the cameras might be a little bit better improved on Samsung's Galaxy Z Flip 5 than this Razer. However, they're very comparable. You can only get such a big sensor into a phone this thin. You're not going to have the best optics. It is what it is. You're going for the foldable convenience, not the actual camera quality, unfortunately. But you cannot go wrong with this baby. Samsung always does have aggressive trade-in offers. They do have other offers to get you started during pre-order phases to kind of lure you away from the competition or from Samsung's own prior generation devices. But you can still find this Razer on sale for less than $900 at all times. I think if you're able to find this for a much more uh, discounted price, we can say, I think this is actually the better option here. Outside display is definitely a little more useful. I know Samsung kind of implemented that folder looking exterior display, but this one right here actually does hold its own. It can use any app on the exterior display. Samsung says they will eventually have that option. Again, you buy something for what it can do currently, not what's promised down the road, and Moto does that here. Sound quality is better. I have the optics, or excuse me, the haptics on this, I think really does good. The hinge, I would probably give to Samsung on that. You can see, yes, it holds up, but it doesn't give you the greatest level of confidence in this, as you can see right there. Um, but aside from that, it just feels good. You have a couple different color options as well. Nothing quite as expansive as Samsung's offering, but it does work and look extremely good. Battery life has been improved here. I think the charging speed is a little better on the Razer here as opposed to the outdated super fast 2.0 charging on Samsung's devices. So these are just personal opinions here. I wanted to get this out there. I'll throw a link up in the description for those Z Flip and Z Fold 5 series devices, as well as this Razer if you guys decide to go that way. They're affiliate links. It always helps, helps us out. I greatly appreciate you guys using them to keep this channel going. Beyond that, let us know what do you want to see for this Razer or for these Fold 5 or Flip 5. Let us know. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.